Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to use the structuring assignment with rest parameter to reassign array elements. In some situations involving array destructuring, we might want to collect the rest of the elements into a separate array. The result is similar to prototype, prototype uh, is array.prototype.slice as shown below. Um, so here we're going A, B, and then it's like put the rest of them here. And so A and B will be one and two, whereas the array will be three, four, five, seven. So that's sort of like a good way to just say, catch all the rest of the data. Variables A and B take their first and second values from the array. After that, because of the rest parameters pr uh, presence, array gets uh, rest of the values, or ARR gets rest, gets the rest of the values from the form, for in the form of an array. The rest el elements only works correctly at the last variable in the list. As in, you cannot use the rest parameter to catch a subarray that leaves out uh, last elements of the original array. Using Use destructuring assignment with the rest parameter to perform an effective uh, array.prototype.slice so that array is a subarray of the original array source with the first two elements omitted. Whoa. Okay, cool. So we want to change this. So here's what we do is we've got the source, which is a constant. We have a function that says remove the, f remove the first two. So we want to say the constant array is equal to list. Um, and then what we're doing is we're passing in list. So we want to return an array. Array should equal three, four, five. Remove the first two. So we could go A, B, and then dot, 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 array. Then ARR is just a variable. Um, this should be, well, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And this should be one, two, three, four, source. Oh, so the source doesn't get changed. Ah, so that's what they want us to do. Yeah, if we run the test, I think this should slice. How would you do it with slice? Um, if you were to console.log source, dot slice four two yeah this would be how to do it with slice and so this is just a, an additional way of doing that why you'd want to use destructuring i'm not exactly sure slice seems a little bit easier but um this uh, should pass the tests anyways so hope this helps you guys and we'll see you in the next lesson